On the 18th of May 2022, HUM Group SXHUM published this explanatory booklet registered with ASIC. And what's interesting is that not all of the members in the board agrees with the transaction with Latitude Finance. In particular, Andrew Abercrombie, the founder of Flexi Group, FlexiPay, or now it's called HUM Group, recommends the shareholders to vote against the transaction. HUM Group share price has been declining since 2013, down to recently about 73 cents per share or market capitalization about $350 million. And interestingly, the majority of that Directors recommends the shareholders to vote in favor of the sale because they say the price offered by Latitude is attractive and the HAM shareholders would further benefit from the synergies between Latitude and HAM Group Consumer Finance. And also independent expert Kroll has concluded that HUM Consumer Finance HCF sales is fair and reasonable and therefore in the best interest of HUM shareholders, they should vote in favor. The independent expert Kroll has assessed the equity value between $260 million to about $308 million, whereas Latitude is willing to pay $290 to $320 million. However, Andrew Abercrombie, the founder of Flexi Group or Hum Group recommends to voting against the sale because he believes the offer is too low, meaning he believes Hum Group should be valued way more than about the 300 million range and hoping Hum Consumer Finance to carry on and remain listed in its current form. And for your information, Andrew Abercrombie owns about 13.5% stake in Hum Group. And here's the chart where the reasoning of Andrew Abercrombie comes from. That is comparing the enterprise value and the gross merchandise volume. For example, in the acquisition of Afterpay, Square, now Block Inc. valued Afterpay at $39 billion with net tangible asset about $1.1 billion and enterprise to merchandise volume about 1.6x price to net tangible asset or 39 divided by 1.1 is about 33x and if you compare that with with latitude proposition of about 300 million or 0.3 billion dollars enterprise value and net tangible asset about 200 million that is an enterprise value to merchandise volume ratio about 0.3x and the price to the net tangible asset about 1.8x. So if you compare it after pay about 33x and the current proposition from latitude is 1.8x and that's why Andrew is recommending shareholders to vote against the transaction. More information on Andrew Abercrombie, Flexi Rent also rented the premises owned by Andrew Abercrombie, where they spent about 185,000 in 2022 and about 230,000 in 2021. However, the lease has been terminated.